just don't tell me you dish all those foods for Chubi. Yes, mom. They are all for Chubi. Why? Because we just got a new place. A duplex at that. So you will be good for us. Yes, mom. A big duplex. For who <laughs> and whom? For us. <laughs> us? Yeah. <laughs> So all those food will make sense. You will just put it in the fridge and then get to microwave and eat. So mom, you can go and fish yourself something to eat. Um, I overheard your telephone conversation with Chubi. Oh really? So, what's your take on that? Are you off duty? I mean today? Hey. Since when did you start putting interest? In young people's relationship and love please, lives. Please come off it. I was once young and I'm not old either. Oh. And there's this saying that goes, business before pleasure. In what business and pleasure are you talking about? Baby. Mom? When you have a good job. I mean, when you have a good job that fetches your income, first it. First, it judiciously, and marriage was certainly certain. Oh, I think work should wait. Why pleasure first? Pleasure first. Excuse me, mom. I got to go. I have to go. Let me pick up the food. I have to walk. Aren't you showing this guy you are desperate? Desperation kills love and she refuses to understand. Sit yourself, girl. So, yeah. Now, welcome to our humble home. I'm home. On you. Babe, wait. You mean this is our new home? Of course. Oh my god! Oh god, baby. I love you so much. I love you, mom. This is beautiful. We got a dining room. Yes! Where I will be making sumptuous meals for you. I trust you. <laughs> Baby, I'm so excited. He is very beautiful. I'm glad you love it. I love it. Let me show you around. Be sure. Oh, no. Get our luggages from the car truck. <laughs> oh God, baby, I love it so much. Baby. Baby. What's up, love? <laughs> you good? Yeah, I'm fine. Baby. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. <laughs> I can see excitement written all over your face. Yes, you made me feel like a woman. Yeah, no, good sex can be a lot. <laughs> I've been missing a lot. You're welcome. You're to me. Thank you. So when, when next are we repeating that? Every day we meet. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> every day we meet. Yeah, every day. <laughs> Do you want something? I want to do it. I want a glass of juice with you. Okay, baby, I'll be right back. Oh, my God. <laughs> You walked as though you've been tampered with. Hmm. My darling. That's exactly the situation I am in. Yeah. 
What situation? Debbie, how old is this house rent? 24 hours. In less than 24 hours, you've lost your virginity. Until what? Mitchell, I don't understand you. Like, what are you insinuating? Honestly, what's your problem? Yeah, okay, let me make it clear to you. Have you forgotten? We have been dating for five good years. Five good years. Haven't we tried? We have tried. What are you We've saying? We have tried. No, you haven't. Wait, let me ask you. Is it because he didn't have a house of his own all these years that you didn't allow him to touch you? Because I don't get it in less than 24 hours and you already who please spare me all that. Are you are you trying to advise me based on your own experience? Of course, yes, I need to advise you from my own experience because it's obvious you have no experience on this. Uh, which your please, I don't have strength in your while. Okay, you're just a silly girl. Leave me. As you can see, the deed has been done and I don't see any damage in it. Are you okay now? You think so? Rest. You think so? <laughs> I know so. I'm giving you a couple of days or let's say some weeks. Let's see how it goes. Mitchell, you like problems. Oh, you think lots. there's no damage, right? No. Just feel this. Relax, you're just being jealous. Hey. Baby girl, if you know how it feels. You know, that's, that feeling is something you can resist. Mm. <laughs> Just two, four hours. Let and it boom. go. Yes. Let boom. Uh, Debbie. Debbie. You know how sweet my baby is. Debbie. That's why. Okay. Michelle. Everything in this whole wide world is on this list. Mm -hmm. So where is the money going to come from? From this house, of course. Which house? This house rent alone is about four million five hundred thousand, right? <laughs> so because of that, you wrote all these things. Ah, Mitchell. So, Debbie. So, I don't have shame for your wahala. Please, if you are going to be walking as though, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, you better stay and let me go alone. The wahala is so much. Are you going or not? I don't have shame for your wahala, please. This is your too strong. Let's go. You are sleeping by this time of the day. Is that why I pay your salary? No, 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 sir, no, sir. So, so, so many problems, sir. So many problems. Yes, ma'am. Like? My ma, they ma, 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 hand. Oh. My, 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 my picking school fees. Your mom, they hospital. Yes. Your picking school fees. Yes. 
stupid. You are very, very stupid. How is that my business? Oh. Yeah? Mother, please, please, please. Why? Please. Why? Why will you let please. your family problem please. affect your job? Please. Please. Your mom is sick. Is that my business? Please. You know why I want my mother? No, 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 sir. If my mama is sick, I will tell you. No, 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 sir. I will pay your salary. No, no. You so why will you bring your family problem? In fact, no, no. you know what? No, 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 no. Just say like that. Okay. okay He's sir. here for seven days. Okay, sir. Anymore. Okay, sir. Okay. As my old guy is enjoying over there, me, I'm enjoying here. As <laughs> the birthday party is going on, I'm enjoying it. Bishop, enjoyment. Mmm. So sweet, so sweet. Bishop, <laughs> this is your turn. <laughs> it's going to be a GM. No longer I get one. GM. <laughs> Bishop, you're enjoying. Mm. Very sweet. <laughs> Made in UK, no wonder. Very sweet. <laughs> yeah, who is there? Who is there? <laughs> <laughs> come in, come in. You're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. You can proceed. I am fine, sir. You're welcome, sir. The party goes on. Bishop, you are drinking UK wine. <laughs> Oh, made in UK. <laughs> Bishop. <laughs> so, Chubi, tell us. How old are you today? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, um, I am, I'm plus one today. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they all say. Oh my <laughs> word. Plus one. Plus one. <laughs> Just plus one. You know? <laughs> <laughs> one double. This is bullish. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Thanks. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, my baby said. He's plus one mm -hmm. means he's old enough to be my baby. What a lovely day. You know? Stupid question. Do you understand? Baby. Yeah. You see, today, I want you to enjoy yourself. Okay. Because it's your birthday. Mm -hmm. That's what's up. So, drink up, eat, marry. We're Thank all you. here for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you drink from mine. Mm. <laughs> Are you jealous? <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, baby, I'll be right back. Oh. One minute. Card. And I don't remember inviting you 
or your sugar daddy to this party. Yes. Now listen, go ahead, have fun, eat chicken because um, I know it's been a while you had some. Mary, but don't forget, try to live on notice. I don't care. Who are you? I don't get to know who you are. It's not my business. I'm just giving you the last one. Don't dare me because she won't like it. Wow, what a lovely chicken. Well spiced. Well grilled, fine, lovely. Love it. Baby, are you having fun? Yeah, yeah, yeah. good. You want more drink? Go for it. More drink here. Sure, you will have more. Mm -hmm. Alright, thank you. Are you Enjoy okay? <laughs> yes, I'm fine. <laughs> Mommy, do you like it? No. Well spot. I know. Mm. I know you love chicken. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you alright? I'm fine, Ma. Are you sure? Please for me. When you can't see the sun. Oh. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. I'm doing that already. Next year, on is gonna be. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Baby, are you alright? I want you to be happy, baby. <laughs> you know, I love you so much. Mary, guys. <laughs> Mitchell, you know what? I have come to terms with my sense of reasoning that the devil, the unknown devil called Lucifer is not a woman but a man. <laughs> Baby! <laughs> Do you know why I'm laughing? Why are you laughing? <laughs> At least you are awakened from your honey wine. I mean, how could you have thought that the, the devil that deceived the whole wide world is a woman? A lazy brat. Oh, they play. <laughs> it's quite unfortunate. Seriously. Oh, wait. What are you thinking? I mean, what are you insinuating? Explain this to me. Tell me why he would give Chubi a brand new car as a birthday gift and then 4.5 million naira. 4.5 million naira. Just like that. Hmm. Explain it to me. Come to think of it. What is the interest? What is the rationale? As well as the value of Chubi's birthday to the elder's family. Now you get it. Now you're on the same page with me. Because I don't understand. What is he trying to achieve? I don't know his aim. I heard you don't. What's up? You cannot handle the mystery. 
at hand. Because it could may or may you if care is not taken, thereby leading you into doing so many evil things and you wouldn't want to, would you? Mom, I don't understand. So you want me to fold my hands and then watch that Hilda, that girl, to snatch my man away from me? Is that what you want? I will not. Be happy. Listen, the only solution is for you to pray. Just watch and pray. And another thing, real men can't be stolen. Get that. Look into my eyes, baby. You know I love you. I want to make that. Just tell me. Mom, I want. Bishop. Bishop, come here. Auntie. <laughs> Who owns this car? Ah! Auntie. It's your car key. I don't understand. Are you joking or what? It's your khaki from Mr. Elder for your engagement to Chuti. This love cannot be tempered. <laughs> it's a lie! Ah! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! This is huge! Yes! Are you serious? To, to pack my things out of your house. Enjoy. Enjoy? Won't you come with me upstairs to help me carry some of my heavy objects? Help you carry some of your heavy objects? Yes. I don't... I don't understand. Is it that you're very, very comfortable and happy I'm leaving your house. Yes, I'm comfortable and happy because you have refused to accept the truth. I told you she's my sister. So what's the biggie? Why are you dramatizing? Since you've refused to accept the truth, suit yourself. What are you saying, babe? I should suit myself. Right? Yes. After taking my virginity, right? I was not saying a virginity. You took my virginity too. So what was don't manipulate me here. How am I sure that guys can even be a virgin? No, guys, guys can never be virgins. You are the only ones that can be virgins. I was also a virgin before I met you. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to stay here. But why can you do this to me? I'm not going anywhere. I'm not. Just food. Rest. Rest in Jesus' name. You took my virginity and you're telling me I should rest. You took my virginity too. But mine was very tight. Uh, how do you experiment mine? Bring needle now. Fresh it up. Oh, 
question. Why did you accept the gift if that was not the case? Baby. Baby. <laughs> Baby, I didn't want to fall your hand and moreover, it was a gift and gifts, they say, are not meant to be rejected. Listen, why did you accept the gift when you have concluded in your mind that she's my girlfriend? We may just explain it now that it was a gift. And gifts are not meant to be rejected. That simply means you are encouraging and supporting us. Never. Mm -hmm. I can Really, is that what you think? It is what it is, baby. No, baby, don't even say that. All I want, baby, is... You know I love you so much. I just want you to be all mine. Kiss me and tell me that I'm the only woman that you love so much. Avoid me. It's on your mom's face. No. Avoid me. Maybe stop saying that. Don't avoid me. How can you say you should avoid you? There's no way I can avoid you. Baby. Just avoid me. You can't run away from me. I'm the only one that you know. Why are you feeling proud? No way. It's a neighbor offense. No way. You tell me you love me. Mom, I'm not just happy. Why can't you be? Just tell me he loves me. I don't understand. What are you trying to say? I'm saying that. Why can't he say it to my face? Baby, I love you so much. Baby, listen, some men are like that. So let it be, okay? I can't let it be. That is four little words and so many people can say it. Why not? Is there something you're lacking? He gives you virtually everything. Attention, love, caring. Mention it. Mom, boy. Mom, is there anything wrong for me to say it? Baby, I love you. I love you. Can you just let this man be and be serious with your life? Mom, why can't you see it to my face? Why can't you see it to my face and tell me how he feels? Now listen. You say love is a four-letter word. But very difficult for some people to say. Love has been expressed in so many ways. He cares about. He gives you attention. What else do you want? Besides, he's not your man because he hasn't proposed. Mom, he's my man. What do you mean? My husband-to-be. I don't understand. Have you done it with him? Do what? I'm asking you, Debbie. Excuse me, Mom. I'll Debbie, I am asking you. Have you? Mom, I just said I'll be in my room. Debbie! Mom? Debbie! Debbie, listen! I'm up! Just tell me you love me. Oh my god. You love me. Let's just go. Sure. You're yeah, the last man standing. Before and after me. Can't you see this love? Baby, just tell me you love me. Um, Hilda, actually, um, I came to say um, I'm so sorry about the way I reacted at um, Chubby's birthday. It wasn't intentional. I think I overreacted, so I said to myself. I should come and talk it over with you. You know we women, you know how we behave when, when it comes to our men. Yeah. <laughs> so, just let everything be bygone. You know? You, right? Yeah, yeah. So please, just um, let bygone be bygone, okay? Um, it's, it's okay, Debbie. It's fine. I was just pissed over and then ashamed of myself. You know I have all it takes to put you behind bars. But it's fine. Forgiving you. Yeah, um, I also came to say thank you to your father. 
but it's obvious he's not around. Help me say, send my message to him that I'm very, very grateful for the gift and I accepted it with my whole heart. Thank you so much. It's fine, it's fine, Debbie. He, he stepped out, I think he stepped out. Please say me well to him when he gets back. Alright, thank you. Um, did Mitchell? Thank you so much. Uh, regards to your father. Yeah, please see me well to him. Alright, bye. And you ended up doing what with my money? I, I, I played betting. Okay, is it my, my with my friend money? Okay, it's Gabriel. Gabriel, my friend. He said, if I use the thirty thousand to play, I will win six point five million. Then I will remove the full money. Okay. I didn't know that Asla would cut it. Please. Okay. I didn't, I didn't know six point seven million with that. My target. And Asla cut it. Yes. They also cut it. No, I did it. Oh no. Any matter. Okay, listen. Please. Please, can you imagine? Please. I gave this idiot money to buy fuel. He ended up using that money to bet. And now he's telling me that Asna cut. Asna cut what? The majesty. Listen, the get out of this compound. Do not return here except to come with my fuel. He said, I bring back my fuel or the way Asna they cut the game. They don't cut your work. No, so, I said, get out of this. Go, 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 go now. Pony, please, so that you don't enjoy me, okay? Can you imagine? This will be more complex. Nonsense. Sure. I gave him money to buy fuel. He ended up betting with it. Telling me, oh God, oh God, what's my business? Let me cut out. With what I saw on the street moment ago, I suggest we leave this place quietly. <sighs> Granddaddy, I have no with you. Because Chubi might kill the gate man and bury him in your bedroom. That might lead us to, tr to trouble. So I think we should leave without any gate man. Gate man or no bishop? Let's leave. Let me go and get my stuff. Inside. Life is mystery. Sometimes it is not over yet. Oh, it is over. It is over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Not at all. It is over. Sometimes it is not over yet. It is over. It is over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Sometimes it is not over yet Until it's over Anger can be very dangerous Distance yourself from it I'm now fully set to return back to what I learned for a living Forgive that revenge, no matter, no matter what. Take it easy. This life is mystery. Yeah. We are all passerby, passerby. Don't allow anger to limit your future. Don't allow anger to destroy all your beautiful, beautiful. Hi, Mr. Famous. How are you? And where are you headed? I'm fine. I'm actually going somewhere. I'm waiting for a taxi. Okay. Michelle. You've not said anything concerning what I told you the last time on us having a day together. 
Mr. Famous, I've told you before. I have a fiancé and I don't double date. Excuse you. See you some other time. Michelle, having a fiance will still stop us from dating. Happy to see you again, my brother Jimmy. It's been, been a long time. I also don't work, man. You just did, you just the manage. Yeah, also, I feel like you're not a ghost of business. Why you can't get me like this? My office is there. Me, the ghost of business. I decrease. <laughs> I don't know if you do, man. Well, That's one. I'm blessed, though. Happy to see you. You're not a big boy. But in real, so. You're managing. Cheers, man. Cheers. You're not a big boy. I can confirm. How do you think they know you, though? Because of you can see how small you do, but see your fleet of cars now. Yeah. And a starter park now, you can stay for bush. <laughs> starter park now, and your house and your car. Don't you don't need to, you don't, you don't need to wind me. You can't wind me. You're not a big boy. No, no, no. Chubby, Chubby, my man. <laughs> Chubby, my man. Hey, soldier. <laughs> You're not a big boy. Okay, I claim it. I'm happy for you. I'm happy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, how's business? We are pushing, bless God, mission in progress. That's it's good. not easy, but we are pushing. That's good. At least we have the turn of level. You guys are doing business. We are inside the bush fighting for you people. Now, now, all nine to pass. So <laughs> two for seven will take you for seven. <laughs> what will I do, Pan? I can only look at Evelyn. Evelyn. Uh, Jimmy, so Bomb will never block your ear. No. With me. I don't go there with caution. No. Thank you, Jesus, for everything you've done. Thank you for making this happen. I pray that no negativity will be service in my daughter's traditional marriage. Everything will align according to your wishes for us. Thank you, Father, because only in your name will a prayer be answered. And you promise us that we're not going to service any negativity. I pray for Chubi and my daughter. I pray for their traditional wedding. I pray that everything will align. I pray that no evil covering, no evil push will take place on that day. You are my God. And you say that whatever I ask, you will answer me. I ask for a successful traditional marriage. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Amen. Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Mom, oh my dear. <laughs> You've been praying since you woke up for Chubi and I. Aren't you tired? Of course, I can't get tired praying for my children's breakthrough. It's not possible. It is not. Okay? Besides, <laughs> one doesn't get tired praying. No I prayer understand. can be enough. It's true. I even need to call Chubi. I need him to get things for my birthday ready. I don't want stories. <laughs> I want you to be back before 12 o'clock to join me in prayer. We need to close by 12. <laughs> I mean 12 noon. Can you do that? Oh, mom. Let God answer the one she prayed. No prayer is enough. The Bible says, pray without ceasing. Pray until something happens. You're right, mom. But when I have a praying mom, <laughs> I don't have anything to worry my head about. Today, <laughs> I've not closed my fast. I want you to join me. Tell God what you need from Him. There is power in spoken words. So I believe 12 you. noon it is. I'll try my best. I'll be waiting. All right, Mom. Okay. Yeah. I am waiting. All right. You come to the sea. You come to the sea. 
Rest and doesn't need to talk too much. Talk to me. Please tell me. Talk to me. Is okay. he going to be fine? Of course. I hope he did not yes. show any injury. No, 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 no. It will be fine. Right? Yeah. Okay, now. <laughs> oh my God, Rachel. <laughs> How did you get yourself in this mess? Rachel, <laughs> finish. <laughs> I'm finished. Oh, I'm finished. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see, you need to calm down. He will be fine. Are you sure? The doctor already said so. Hey, oh. help you. Baby, please. I'm finished. I'm finished. Rachel, I'm finished. What am I going to do? Be strong, okay? Um, I'll be in the reception so that you both can chat. Baby, how are you today? I will be fine. Yes. We need a serious lawyer for this case. In that case, baby, I need to go and do proper inquiries to get a good lawyer that can help you win this case. Please, you need to keep hope on life, I beg you. I'll be back, baby, okay? Oh, 
Alright. Open the gate. Ah, but madam, I'm not with the keys. I don't understand. Are you not supposed to be the new gatekeeper? So open the gate. <sighs> madam, I wasn't given the keys. How may I help you, please? Who are you? And why are you here? Excuse me, sir. Sorry, who are you? I am Officer Jimmy. Oh, okay. Um, my name is Debbie. I'm Chubby's fiancé. I came to take one of the cards so I can sell it off and be able to raise money for Chubby's um, lawyer because Chubby will soon be going to the court. Sir, please, can we go inside? You can see the house is locked. Yes, we can see it. Can you please open? I will advise you to seek for your alternative elsewhere. Um, sir, please, um, you can just keep this for your stress. Don't encourage corruption. Pearls. Now move it! Stop, sir. Move it! Let's go, let's go. There is inflation here and there in the economy. And the 10 million naira I asked you to get is quite small compared to the male counterpart in the field. You and I know the case I'm handling is not a child's play. Madam. I beg you, can we pay five million naira? Please, that's all we have. I'm begging you, please. I know five million is a huge amount of money, but I'm sorry. The least I can go is 9.5. Hey. And that's last and final. 9.5 million naira. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, so there is nothing you can do for us. Nothing at all. Nothing. Nothing. I'm sorry. Okay, it's fine. Um, thank you so much, madam, for your time. We will, we will get back to you if anything changes. Listen, you have to be very fast. Very fast, so I can proceed with my plans. If not, you know what the consequences may be. Thank you so much. Yeah. We'll get back to you. Escape from hell. Ah, you can say that again. Robert, you're very stupid to have brought such menace to me. What? Did you just call me stupid? Your, your mother's stupid. Oh. Eh? For goodness sake, your employment is less than 24 hours. And you left your master's gate keys at where exactly? Eh? In fact, I don't even care. And wait, did you actually try forcing the gate open? Oh, shit. Huh. See, thank God I came with you. Don't even expect me to approve of your confirmation. After making me share from your lashes. You're not seeing that. Ah. So where are you going? Ah,
me. Oh, God, I just, I just received a call now. No, they've moved the Chubi to police custody. Listen now, they, they, they will sue him to court. Have you found any defense counsel? Oh, I don't know. Next thing that they will charge him to court. Debbie. Mom. Calm down. Okay? Have you found any defense counsel? Where will I get money to do that? What are you saying? I thought you said Chubi is winning in money. I thought you said he's winning in money. Yes, Mom, I did. I said all that just to cover his ass. Mom, I really love him so much. I oh, will... Are you saying that he has no money? Are you trying to insinuate that he doesn't have any family member to come to his rescue at this critical time in his destiny? Is this flattering, Mom? This is no time for this. Oh. This is time for you to commiserate with me. And let's put hands together and see a way to help him out. We are all he, he, he has. Mommy, please. All I do. We are all he has. Yes. Um. Come. Let's see. <sighs> Mommy loves you. Very much. I never meant to hurt you. No. Just remember that I love you so much. Hmm? Thank you. But Chubi loves you more. Mom, what did you just say? Always remember that Chubi loves you more. Thank you so much. Don't mm worry -hmm. too much. This is all I needed to hear to push on. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I I need to go and make some calls. Sure. So I will know where to start from. I'm just confused. Don't worry, take your time. All right, mm -hmm. ah. Easy. Okay, mommy. Mm -hmm. Look at the oh. I love you, ladies. I always have. Honestly. Easy. Be careful, okay? Why did you allow Debbie quit her job yesterday? She did? You're not aware? Over what? Because they declined her request to take a loan of 20 million naira from the bank. 20 million naira loan? Was the money meant to buy a house? Mom, she knows what she wants to do with the money. By the way, is she at home? Huh? Is she at home? Uh, yes. In her room. Just to have sought out a boy, a boyfriend that is not her husband. This is absurd. This girl. This girl has gone nuts.
babe. Why are you still like this? I need you to know that Chubi loves you. Yes. Yes. He loves me so, so much. Yes. Yes. He loves me so, so much. You're so mad over this guy and I don't know why. Mitchell, what are you saying? Come on. This is the only man I've ever known. My husband to be. Why are, you, why are you sounding like this? Why? And you're ready to die for him? Of course. If the case be it, I will. I will die for him. I will. <laughs> I learned to train the towel on your banking job. Of course. I did. Because they refused to give me the loan I asked for. Come on, I did everything. I made sure I got customers, good, good customers for them. I worked and worked and made sure I made so much money for them. Now I needed their help. What did they do? I need them to give me money to help my man. Now they refused. And you, and you asked me to go back to there? No, you should take their work. I'm not, I'm not doing it again. Debbie. Yes? You are not yet married to Chubi. And you've lost your job. God forbid he dies in prison after the trial. What becomes of you? Now I'm asking you a question. And I need you to answer me. How well do you know Chubi? Do you know where he comes from? His state? Do you, do you know his village? Do you know his family background? Do you even know Chubi's genotype? Debbie, I need you to think. I mean, I need you to be wise. Because I won't talk to you about this again. By the way, where is the engagement card you were given? Huh? Just tell me you love me. <laughs> you love me. You lost your virginity to him. And now you're trying to raise a whooping 20 million naira on his behalf. Where is all of this taking you to? Just tell I won't talk to you about this again. I beg to leave. Okay. You're the only friend I've ever had. You can't blame me for all this. You have heard everything you said. Please don't go. I've heard everything you said. I mean, everything you said. I mean, see, Michelle, I'm, I'm only doing what I know. And what I feel is best. I want you to stay over so that we can talk it through and then you will educate me more. Please, don't leave me. Debbie. I'm still under my parents' roof. I don't have a say of my own. Remember, Chubi loves you. Baby, please don't leave me. Sometimes it is not Sometimes it is not over. I will do my best 
to make sure that she be gets a fair judgment. Yeah, good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? Are you set? Yes, I'm ready. I can see you're still sad. Don't worry. Everything will be fine, okay? It's all right, thank you. <sighs> Mom? Mm -hmm. uh, we'll have to go now. That's all right. <clears throat> Mommy, we'll see you when we're back. Okay, easy. Bye. Bye. Yeah. All right. If anything comes up, let me know. Good day. Good day. How may we help you? We are family of the accident victim. Mm. The late Mr. Ajay Sowawagba was my dad. Here is my mom, Mrs. Abigail. <coughs> Again, how do we help you? We've come against all odds to extend our heartfelt condolences to your family. May the soul of the faithful departed through the mercies of God rest in peace. Amen. Ma'am, please, we are really sorry for your loss. Please accept our condolences. Compliment accepted but we do not intend having any verbal discussion with you other than lock home in the law courts in two days' time. Sir, please. Well, let's rest that to go. We will discuss this in the law courts. Okay? Good day. To your family, just trust me, it's my family. Don't revenge, forgive, don't revenge, no matter, no matter what. Take it easy, easy. this life is mystery. Yeah. We are all passerby, passerby, don't allow anger. To limit your future, don't allow anger to destroy all your beautiful, beautiful. So otherwise. Otherwise what? I would have slapped him off that seat. Rachel, can you listen? Can you just listen to yourself? Mitchell? we should be at your mercy and not the other way around. What are you saying? 
We're supposed to be pleading, looking for a way to go back there and beg them. Oh, and you're here saying what I don't understand. Babe, please. We can't go back there and beg for any reason again. I mean, we can find better ways to resolve this. Go, go back there and get humiliated again. Please, let's go. You're outside already. You don't want people to see you like this. Please. Please. You have to pull yourself together. Let's go. This life is mystery. Sometimes it is not over yet. Oh. Until it's over. Until it's over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Not at all. Until it's over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Until it's over. Until it's over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Until it's over. Sometimes it is not over yet. Until it's over. <laughs> Hi. What is done is that's life. Good to see you. Whoa, what Daddy, happens to your car? You just broke down and decided to make an it. So I'm just trekking to my office. I was going to your office. Yeah, then let's get there now. <laughs> Good man. You are doing well. You so how's everything? Hop in, hop in, hop in. So what and what did you say you recovered? I recovered his phone and ATM cards. Jesus! So you recovered his phone and ATM card and you held it to yourself all this while and we've been looking for a way to hire a good lawyer for Tubi's case. I intended to submit them at the, as an SB at the police station. Never stop, you're a criminal! No, 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 no. I wanted to submit them at the police station. You wanted to? But I didn't. So my intention is that I will give them to him at the proper time. No, there's no proper time here now, my brother. We need to go to your house. You bring out all the items you have with you. No, I'll give them to him by myself. Okay, I, 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 will, I will tell your clothes here. I'm not joking, you know. I go run into you like this. Don't play that prank with me. What the nonsense is that one? Leave hey, me. Hey, Leave hey, me waiting. Hey, hey, stop it. Ubi, stop that. Stop that. Get your hands off him. Now. Bishop, what is it? Sir, I recovered Chubi's phone and ATM cards and I intended to give them to him at the proper time. Where is it? They are in my house. You, what's your argument? Sir, I only suggested that we should return the items to Debbie, Chubi's wife. You know what? Bishop, we sir. are going to your house. Both of you, enter my car. Now move! Oh, okay, sir. Move! Please. Both of you, move! taking these luggages to? You are even carrying a shovel. What is going on? What am I living for? What am I living for? Give me one good reason why I'm supposed to be alive. My husband is late. My son is in jail. That so-called chief judge is a devil. That man is wicked. He's heartless. How can he sentence an innocent man to die as imprisonment? We were told that the court is the last hope for a common man. A big girl. Please give me this shovel. Let me let me hold it. You bring it now. You can't be doing this. Uh -uh. You can't be doing this now. Eh? I'm your husband's brother. In case you forgot, why are you doing this? Eh? I can even make it bold to tell you that that verdict of the chief judge was correct. What? Yes. What did you just say? How dare you? 
You are very stupid. You are a wicked man. You are heartless. How can you say his judgment was correct? Of course he was correct. I don't want to hear any word from you again. Leave this place now. Leave this place now. I think you should calm down. I will break your head with this. Calm trumpet. down, Abigail. Calm down. I said leave this place. I will break your head with this trumpet. Leave, leave this place. I break your head. We can't, man. Stop it. I will blame you. I will blame you. My problem. My problem is that that eyewitness video clips we watched in court yesterday mm. on how my husband met his death was doctored. Oh. My worry was why the defense lawyer to Chibi Collins appear at such an ungodly hour when we had almost triumphed. Exactly. That is my point. After the chief judge pronounced his jail term on Chubi, he should have dropped the, the, the justice hammer mm. and shout court. Then turn their fears to that suicide defense lawyer who struggled his way into a peaceful judgment. Hmm. You see, the deed is done. The only thing we have to do now is just take away the good things from it. The judge actually gave a technical knockout against your son, Abiodun, citing his uh, default as a student of law. In the Federal Road Safety Act of the use of handsets, where it is prohibited and defined, like using it in the aeroplane, while driving, or while crossing the road, filling stations, gas stations, even in court cities, and what have you. So, it's just a normal. Crying. What for, if I may ask? Mom, you know you're not supposed to be doing this. You know Debbie doesn't have it all together at this moment. You know. We are supposed to be her strength. You shouldn't be doing this, Mom. This is just a trying phase in our lives. And I'm certain it will pass. We are going to testify at the end of the day. So I need you to pull yourself together. Let's look out for Debbie. You shouldn't be doing this, Mom. Please. Thank you. Where is she? In her room. Take it easy, easy, easy. This life is mystery. We are all masabai, masabai. So don't allow anger to limit your future. Santa loves not anger to destroy your <laughs> This life 
To me, that is that what you really want? How old are you again? Hundred. How old are you? I thought you were excited about the pregnancy. How come you, you, you suddenly want to take your life? You're so cool. You should be. I've not paid your price. Stop saying that! Baby, listen to you! Listen to me. You need to pull yourself together. I know this hurts, but you're going too far. You really want to take your life because of a man? Come on, baby girl. You want to do this? Baby, listen. Don't forget that you really love you so much. Boyo, where is my mother? Abiodun, how did you get out of the federal prison? Uncle Boyo, my mission is to kidnap every one of Chubi's family and demand for ransom, and I must avenge my father's death. Nothing stops it. Hmm. Abiodun. If you ask me, I'll tell you to just calm down. Hmm? Calm down, so I can think along with you. There's no time to wait. We have to be on the same page. This way, Mr. Honor. Please. That's why you should give me some time. Give me some time. Life is movement, not stagnant. Stop. 
Yes, yeah, coming. Good evening, sir. Yes, good day. How may I help you? We are police officers from state headquarters. So? Are you Mr. Boyo? Yes, I am. That's good. Now, you are under arrest for the murder of Mrs. Abigail. And by Mr. Moses, you have every right to remain silent. Take it. You got nothing to disappoint me. This life is mystery. Move. Move! Find him? No, sir. I searched everywhere, including the backyard, sir. I couldn't find him. Abiodu, you can run to her for all I care, but I will make sure that I find you. Dead or alive, sir? Yes! Dead or alive. Life Let's go. Is Start now. Life is movement. No, start now. You got to move to succeed. You got moving to disappoint me. This life is mystery. my man you know i visited you on three occasions but you were absent that's what i'm here they be just put to bed twins a boy and a girl wow praise god you know chubi will be happy over this yeah chubi will be happy over this but do you know i visited the prison twice and the policeman in charge turned me off seriously yeah you know, I suffer the same fate on four occasions, but it is well. And do you know that the news has gone viral? I built an escape from prison. And as I speak to you now, a sum of five million naira is placed on his head. He's wanted. Five million naira? Yes. Ah. Do you know I read on the newspaper that Abiodun's mom shot the barrister because the son was being sentenced to prison for 15 years? Jeez. Imprisonment. And and, and, and and currently, as we speak right now, Boyo is being interrogated by the policeman. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hey! <sighs> well, God will see us through. I just pray God sees us through. God sees us through. My gallant officer. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, well, uh, congratulations. You are now the chief judge of the Southern Army. Thank you. Thanks for the cost of the food we have hatched. Thank God. At least two years jail time is not that bad for mass protesters. That's true. That's true. That's true. I'm actually coming to your office. Yeah. Yesterday was a two B students training ceremony. Wow. That was for most education. 
Tell me, what are we having for a breakfast? A cup of coffee is okay for me. No, Grandpa. Eggs, sorry, Hello? Oh, what a great news. Serious? <laughs> Carton pieces. Oh, my God. No, she will be out there. She will be here. Yeah. Oh, God is wonderful. Oh my God. So, Grandpa, what's the great news? Debbie gave birth to twin. Oh my God, that's that's a very good news. A boy and a girl for two weeks. Grandpa, Grandpa, we need to pop champagne and have you that breakfast. So, order. Oh my darling, we are going to the house straight away. No now, Grandpa. Let's take breakfast first now. When we come back. Oh, Grandpa, <laughs> no now. Let's take breakfast first. Oh, Grandpa. Love, this movement must start now. Love, this movement must start now. You can move to some sea. You can move into disappointment. This life is mystery. to share our past stories today. Let me start by telling my story. Okay. On that day, I left my house upset because my get man got me angry. So while driving down the road, Debbie called me. Who is Debbie? <laughs> Don't bother about her. Debbie called me, so as I was talking to Debbie on the phone, I knocked down a man who was carelessly crossing the road while I was from college. Oh, it was a horrible experience. I passed out, only for me to wake up in the hospital tomorrow morning and I was told that the man I knocked down died on the spot. Hey. That was how I landed here. Such as you. Hey. Maybe I should tell you, man, too. But tell me, what brought you here? 
This is my 27th year in this prison. During my university years, my friend Tony The big fish just came into town. The big man. The man came in from the States and he came in with a lot of dollars. Don't! Lars! Guy, we don't collect that dollars finish. We don't carry them on our own. My brother, you see this night, I've planned everything because you know we need cash. Very soon we'll graduate from this, this school. And we need a lot of cash to carry babes now, to go clubbing. Guys, I'm not done in pass. My mini cash pass. My go scatter club. Carry guests as I want, but cool. So I've planned all my strategies. All my stuff has been planned. Facts. Ha! Confirm! Who this one? Confirm! What are we kill? Life bullets didn't say that is so easy, so. Oh boy, this night, eh? Show game. Go hot, too. And uh, Jenny. Well, everywhere is true. Everywhere is true. Let's see, give me one light. Give me one light. Chai! My friend, how are you now? I'm fine. I can see that. You're really <laughs> shining. I thank you. Ah, hi, it's Jenny. Jenny is fine. Look at him. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Yes, Good madam. I'm very you, hungry. I need dinner tonight. Oh, yes, sir. I need dinner, please. I need dinner. Stop! 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 Guy, fast! This woman know me. Oh. Ah. This woman know me. Oh. Eh? So I don't fire her. I escape, I escape. Oh, now move on there. Oh, oh, let me. Oh. Oh. What is happening? Oh. What is happening? Rob us. Rob us. Yes. No, I never. Yes. What? She's dead. You took my money. Because she's dead. We need to get this. Please, please. We need to get them. Let's move after them. We need get to get them. God. My money. It's good. Yeah. Kill a pregnant woman. Honestly, I regretted it. I really, really regretted it. It touched me. Anger can be very dangerous. Distance yourself from me. Yes.
be? Why did you stay this long? Don't you? Is this not blood on your neck? I think I fought with somebody at the petrol station, so I used bottle to break his head. To be. Why do you like fighting all the time? You like looking for trouble everywhere. Oh, 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 is it because your father was a soldier? A soldier? Yes. What of my mother? He was a soldier. What of my mother? Oh, your mom. Your mom was my bosom friend. Oh. She was actually working with one rich lady. And a day came, and robbers came to rob the house. They made away with a very huge sum of money. And because she recognized one of the robbers, they shot her. I miss her so much. My mother. My, my mother. Chibi, your father sent me money to buy him a house. And the money is under my bed. So, can see, please take good care of the house. I'm going out, okay? Alright. Ah, money to buy a house. Jesus. I'll take this money to Jamaica. After all, it's my father's money. Too long ago, but she's hungry now. She's hungry. My nipples are paining me. I, I, I can't feed her again. Please, go and eat. We have enough vitamin soup in the fridge. We have fruits. Eat, eat, eat balanced diet so that you can feed them very well. You can feed them very well. Yes. I'm tired. I am tired. What do you Every want minute to they want to eat, they want to eat, they want to eat. I think I should just bundle the both of them and take them to the prison to go and stay with their father. I'm tired. Please, I'm going. Is it your fault? Huh? You had your mother. Eh? Listen, I don't want you to go to a prison. Please, please, please. I'm begging you. Eh? Just shut up. 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 Okay? Dun, 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 dun. What is it? Mom, someone is after Chibi's life as we speak. What do you mean? Mom, he was here to see you, but you were not at home, so I begged him to stay. Then he said here is not even safe for him. He left. What could be the problem? I don't know, I don't know. Mom, you know if anything happens to Chubi, Debbie will not be able to take it. You know how she, she behaves. Is Debbie aware of this? No, Mom. Chubi doesn't want me to tell her. Why? Yes, because... You know how Debbie will react. Have you gotten Debbie on the phone? Not yet, no. I'm just scared of telling her. <laughs> what, what do we do? Where is Chubby now? I don't know. He left. I 
I think he came to tell you. But since you were not at home, he just left. I tried to make him stay. But he said, yeah, it's not safe for him. This all this rubbish. Like Eze goes to school. Oh, my concern is Debbie. I don't, I don't want anything to happen to Chubi. It was a horrible experience. I was on my own when I saw these guys beating a young man restlessly. They caught him with a gift for the city. They were beating him. The guy was at the verge of passing away. Like dying before he sent for me. When I got there, I started to apologize that uh, he was threatening me to kill me. This, that, this, that. Before something happened and they caught him. I should please forgive him. Like he came for me. I was like, you were threatening me to kill me. What for? He said, I should please forgive you. I should please forgive you. He said, well, I'm forgiving you. The moment that I forgive you, the man died. Like he gave up the ghost. <sighs> Who? Babe? Who was the boy? You won't believe this. He was the son of the man I accidentally killed with my car. Wait, 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 wait. Abiodo. Ab One Abiodo like that, right? I know him, baby. You know when you were going there, uh, when you're undergoing your prison sentence, I actually went to meet him and his mom with my friend Michelle. I went to plead with them to please, you know, try to make things to see reasons that it was an accident. I thought he has even forgiven you. Oh my goodness, baby, thank God for your life. What would I have done? Shit is crazy. I don't even know what to see out of it. My God. Thank 
tell me, I don't know. <laughs> don't, you don't, you don't. Okay. You need mixer? No, I do okay like yeah, this. Yeah, let me just. So make I come check on my guy, I don't think. Yes, okay. My name is Hilda. Please, can you tell my brother that the sister is here? Hmm? What did he say? Can you go up there, tell my brother that Hilda, the lovely sister, is here and she has come to stay? that you know that I have put to bed. I gave birth to twins, two, two bouncing babies for Chubi. <clears throat> but if you want to stay in this house and remain a second wife, you're welcome. Please. <laughs> oh, Robert! Robert! Um, sis, can you help me get my luggage from the car trunk, please? Okay, all right, no problem. Um, Barista, thank you so much. Thank you very much for your intervention on my brother's case. You're welcome. I mean, if not for you, the jail terms would have been 20 years or more. Thank you so much, sir. We thank God, everything worked well for His grace. Thank you so much. So what do I offer you? I'm all right, my daughter. You don't need anything? Yes. How about uh, Chubi? Um, he just stepped out. The mood of his dressing, I don't think he's going to anywhere far. Okay, I just came to check on him. All right, sir. Thank you so much. So you mean you don't need anything? Yes, I don't. I'm very all right. Maybe when next I come. Thank you so much. Thank you. So, tell me, are you in court today? No, not at all. The court will be holding tomorrow. Um, Chubi and Hilda here. There's something I've been wanting to let you people know. Hilda, Hilda. The Chief Judge of the Federation, Supreme Court of the Federation, is the biological father to your mother, which makes him your grandfather. Yes. I know you'll be shocked to hear this. Wait. Are you saying that the Chief Justice of the Federation, Ella Hilton, is my grandfather? Yes. He is the biological father to your mom. It shouldn't be. It's called for celebration. It's something we should be happy about. Because here in this family, we have a lawyer, we have a chief judge, we have a soldier, and Chubi here is an engineer. And hi here, I'm a doctor. So we should be celebrating. Yeah, but how come we ever all this one? Well, well, it's you, crazy. You just, this is the day the Lord has made it possible for you to know. So you just have to take it. Cheers to the good news. Are you drinking? Um, no. She doesn't do it at all. So, bro, 
What are we going to do next? So there's a solution because this call for a celebration. Indeed. Yes. Children, you should be happy for this. So, yes. Our granddad. Yes. Wonders shall be How could you, mom? How could you? How could you keep something like that away from me? Your daughter, why? What are you trying to talk about? Because you see this is your shout, I don't have time. Mom? What? Mom, don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. How can you not tell me that Chubi and Hilda, they are nothing but siblings? Why did you allow me to make fool of myself? Why? Because I don't know. Yes, you I do. don't. Mom, stop saying that. You knew about it. You do. Will you stop shouting and make me understand what you are trying to say? What I'm trying to say is, you hid the facts away from your own daughter. What are you trying to achieve? That Chubi and uh, Hilda are siblings? Yes. What do you take me for? A liar? In all honesty, I am getting to hear it from you. Yes. I don't know Chubi from Adam. You brought Chubi to this household. So please, where did you hear that from? Don't worry, Mom. Since you say you're not aware, no problem. But I'm very, very sure and convinced that you are much aware. But you just you chose to just keep it away from me. You know Reasons best known to you. Suit yourself. No problem. Just no suit problem. yourself. Because I don't see any reason why I should know about this. I'm just only sad that I made a fool out of myself. You made a fool of yourself on what? On the fact that I know that we are siblings and I refuse to tell you about it long time before now. Listen, I don't know Chubi, neither Elder. You brought them to the picture. Check it out now. <laughs> this one is for my introduction. Mm, this is beautiful. You like it? I like the stunning. I just, yes. This your designer is good. Mad oh mad. Yeah. You know, when I told her that, I want them to be everywhere with stones. Yeah, like so cool, so cool. <laughs> so by the time I did wear well. it, eh? I like a joke. Yeah. Look at the skirts. When I wear it now, all my KBD, everything will just show. <laughs> <laughs> Mad girl, all of it's a joke. <laughs> it's then this one hmm. is for my traditional marriage. Mm. By the time I wear it, tie my gele with my purse. Oh, I probably just Awesome. Beautiful. You know, when I saw it, I liked it. I fell in love. So I told my baby about it. So he said he liked it too. He's using the same thing, right? Of course. Oh, we're twin. As it should be. Hello. <laughs> it's my wedding. Yeah. So calm down. It's not your wedding. I know. Uh, I know. I know. You don't have to rub it on my face. Uh, let it be my sister. <laughs> it's not easy to get married. You know? Who is this one? Hey. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> and here is the almighty. Almighty. Almighty wedding. <laughs> Can you see it? It's a choke, I mean, no choke. I know. It has to be put. It has to be put. Out of the Expose you. Don't come and show me. You know you're going to have to be stressed. It concerns you, not concerns me. Did you see this story? You're going to show me. You're going to show me. If you like, oh, oh let's babe, take it from anywhere. You were lucky to have gotten this. Of course, and that was why I had to build it. See all the stones. No, it's I, I, it's like, amazing. Seriously, we, you like it, Abby? We picked so well. Mm -hmm. So I told my baby to go and choose eh, the best suit that would suit this, you know? Mm. You like fine, it, right? No one is ever going to believe that it's okay. Oh, hello. When I'm done, you can use it for your life. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> my dress will have to be perfect. 
whatever. You don't have to spend all your money just because she wants to do a wedding. You can do a small wedding okay, and then your home will be good. That is so fresh to me. I know what I want. Oh, I got to do your own husband so that you will enjoy. Say amen. Mm -hmm. So, Grand Daddy, how will the meeting? Mm -hmm. ah. mm -hmm. You there? Yeah, where is the uh, to be? Um, you went to the supermarket to get something. Okay, um... What are you referring to? Has she come? Oh, uh, she alright? Not yet, not yet. No, the huh? I think she'll come very soon. Okay. Yeah? Good afternoon, ma. Good day, sir. How are you? I'm very well. I'm yeah. here. Um, you are? Oh! Jubi's the fiance? Sit down, sit down. Oh. What's your name? I'm Debbie, ma. Oh, Debbie? Yes, ma. Wow. Such a pretty girl. Please make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. You wrote to us for my day. And tell Jubi to come right away. His fiance is here. Yeah. Okay, Grandpa. Right away. She's beautiful. You can say that again. <laughs> yeah, my dear, you're very beautiful. And I hope you'll be of good behavior. <laughs> wow. And the next thing is just to visit her people and uh, pay her diary. I think I like her. Me too. Yes, I like her. I hope I'm on the right track. Everything is powerful. <laughs> oh, pretty cool. Which one should I use? I'm checking. Since your dress has yellow, uh, I want something that makes me very, very beautiful. What? Are you still dressing up? No, we're almost done. What do you mean almost done? Almost. The yellows are here already. Are you serious? I'm speaking with you. Chubby's grandmother is seated at the ground floor. Uh, are you not supposed to come and say hi? Hey, mommy, let her wait. Please, Please. can this wait? No. Mom, let her wait. I'm already coming. Oh, I need to look good before she comes to me. Please! Be quick! Let me go and see the Ketra and know what they are doing. Mommy, the food and the drinks. I'll go see about all those. See the drinks and. Michelle? Mom, am I speaking to someone? Yes, Mom. Please be quick! Okay. I need you downstairs as soon as possible. Okay, alright. Okay. Right. So, what should I do? How can you waste your time with gold? Is this your value? It's gold? Yes. Now I'm going to share you the longest pricing to go for this. No, I'm just joking. Yes, mom. Easy. So, which car are we using, mom? Driver! Oh, you have a guest. So, arrange my dress. You have a guest. Welcome, sir. Which one are we using? Baby, you look so good! Hey, <laughs> Chumi! You look so good! <laughs> Baby, do you know him? He's your father. Huh? What? How? Hey. Baby. You mean this is your father? I don't know. I'm, I'm even surprised, Mom. My father. How? Where have you been? Mom, what are you saying? This marriage is cancelled. Uh -uh. What are you saying? Me. I, baby! Baby, wait! Hey. Mom, what? Mommy, what are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? Talk to me! What are you saying? I am asking you! Talk to me. Who is my father? Anger can be very dangerous. Distance yourself from me. If you wanna wanna live long. If you wanna wanna live long. Don't revenge. Forgive. Don't revenge. No matter, no matter what. 
take it easy, easy. This life is mystery. Yeah. We are all passerby, passerby. Don't allow anger to limit your future. Don't allow anger to destroy all your beautiful, beautiful. Explain to me the disaster you caused at my wedding. Start talking. Explain to me. I know you're not deaf. You can hear me, right? Debbie, don't you dare Debbie me. Please, you need to calm down. Don't you so dare say out. a word to me. You think I'm stupid? Start talking. Oh, you think I'm joking with you? You see? You no, you think I'm joking with you? spent 15 million in this wedding that did not hold. I'm sure you have not really had that. Not at all. Honestly, we are yet to be told what happened or what went wrong. Not to be Debbie or Zimet has come forward to make any explanation. Daddy. I think you should summon Chubi for questioning. It was a fraud. I have this feeling it might be connected to Daddy's foundation. I have some feelings too. You have? That's what I felt. Having that feeling, honestly. <sighs> Julie, crying solves no problems. Just be humble and accept your corrections. Chubi, be a man. Chubi, never fight to run away. You know why? It is unethical. Confine the nurse as your king's man. Okay. That man. That man that walked into that wedding ceremony. The man that made me change my mind. That man. Uh, that man, that man what? What happened? That man. That man killed my mom. We buy them. How? Oh. I concur. Just tell him. He just came out of prison. Julie, if I may ask you, 
Who is your information source? I was in prison with him. He told me everything himself. That man killed my mother. Jesus! Jesus. My life. You ruin my life. You want us to flock together. As pets of this affair. God. Debbie. This is a family affair. We can talk about it. And sort it amicably. My dear daughter, I'm so sorry. I know I failed in my obligation. I know I failed you as a mother. I don't even know what to explain. I don't know how to go about this whole thing. I was so naive. Back then, I was just living life. I didn't even know what Stephen was into at the time until the case came up. And shortly after that, I found out that I was pregnant with you. I don't know. That's why I told you that you don't have a father, that your father is late. I didn't want to explain this to you. Because I don't know what to tell you. I don't want you to know that your father was serving a jail time for 27 years. My fear was that it would affect your growth. Please. Lena, please, you have to forgive me. Please. There is no need crying. When the head is off. Why didn't you tell me? Like, I can't, I can't put this whole thing together. I've tried to comprehend all this, but I can't. You need to calm down. Please. I understand how hot you are. Please take it easy. Why didn't you tell me? Like, I'm trying to... I'm trying to... Like, put my head around all this. I can't... I can't still comprehend all this. Are you saying to my face that the same man, Steve, who killed Chubby's mom is the same man that gave it to me. Is that what you're saying? No! Christ, Christ, Christ! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! I don't know. I am so sorry, please. I'm sorry. Oh my God! God, Christ, Christ, Christ. You want to tell me I am a product of ungodly 
silliness. Is that what you're saying to me? Me, Debbie. Why didn't you tell me that I had a father who went to prison for 27 years? Why didn't you tell me I had a father who is a robber? I'm a product of ungodliness. The same man that killed you, his mom, is the same man that is my father. How could you, Mom? Why did you tell me? Mom, why did you keep this away from me? Have I ever kept anything away from you? My thoughts were close. That we could share everything together. How could you do this to me? You couldn't even tell me. My own father. My father was seven in jail for 27 years. 27 years. I didn't even know that I had a father. No fatherly love. I've always thought my father was late. She lied to me. You made me believe I had no father. You didn't even tell me my father was a murderer, an arm robber. How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me when I thought everything was going to be fine? When I felt I've already seen something to be happy about. Everything is clashing down my eyes. And I can't even do anything. You see you. And you call yourself a mother? You know what? You disgust. You know what I feel like doing? I feel like strangling you. You disgust me. I am disgusted. Mom, I am disgusted. Who knows everything you've been keeping away from me? Oh my God. So you mean you haven't met with Chubi of recent? away from me. He took my pride away from me. <laughs> Have you forgotten? I even gave birth for him. I gave birth to two sets. Two sets of twins. Oh. I was there for him. I was there for him. I was there for him. At his low moment, I was there. I was holding on for him. I was believing that tomorrow is going to be a good day. I was believing that tomorrow is going to be a good day. How am I supposed to know that everything will come crashing? Crashing all over my head. Does it mean? All the love that he was professing to me, that he loved me. Does he mean they were all a charade? Does he mean he was joking? Does he mean he was joking? We need to stop. We need to stop. Look, this situation might be beyond you. Definitely not beyond God. God, you see me! You see me! You see me! Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. God, you see me! I don't deserve this. You see me! I don't deserve this. 
<laughs> now listen to me. I need you to fix a meeting with Chobi in his house. But I won't be coming with you. Do you understand? I don't think you want to see me. I don't think he thinks they need you. Let me listen to me. Debbie. Debbie, that's a no. As the new get man, always focus on your job. Do you understand? My name is Chubby. That's it. Chubby, sir. Add some reference to my name. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. When I said my name is Chubby, does not mean you call me Chubby. Are you mad? Sorry, sir. Sorry, boss. Sorry, boss. Rule number one. No one visits my house without calling me on the phone. Yes, boss. Not even my father. Do you understand? Yes, boss. Now get back to it. Thank you, boss. You're welcome, sir. Um, please, what can I offer you? There'll be no need for that. I'm actually in a hurry. I learned to just go to where they <laughs> Though you didn't tell me about it. I'm so sorry, sir. You know, the, the marriage was not um, planned by us. It was Chubi's family that organized it. That was why we didn't inform you. I'm so sorry. Um, well, I brought this gift for you, um, for your wedding. You can have it. the whole thing. Well, like I said, I'm actually in a hurry, so I have to be on my way now. Please take care of yourself. Sir, please, on their behalf, I have come to beg. It's quite unfortunate that things had to happen this way, sir. Leaving the marriage is not the right thing to do, sir. Let's settle these things amicably, sir. Please, sir. Baby, baby, please, I'm begging you in the name of God and everything you hold sacred. Baby, please forgive us because of our children. Please, I'm begging you. Listen, with all due respect, Pastor, I am no longer interested. 
that this is not the way to settle these things. Leaving the marriage is not actually the right thing to do, sir. I have decided to remain single for the rest of my life. What about the children, sir? What about the children, please? I'm begging you. Thou shalt not kill us in the Bible. Even the Bible said that. Even the Bible said that shall not kill Sir, please. Sir, please. Please, sir. 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 tells me that if the foundation be destroyed, what can the righteous do? Baby, your mother's costly mistake has done enough damage. And the only way out of this is for both of you to forgive each other and confess your sins. Only out. Okay? Please, can we pray? Let's bow our eyes. Oh. oh, honey, you're back already. Yeah. Oh. So, um, how did the meeting go between you and Chubby? How did it go? The 15 million naira I spent is by God. Chubby told me face to face that he's not going to marry Debbie. Even when I promised him that I'm going to spend another 15 million naira. You know what? He told me directly to my face that over his dead body to get married to Debbie. You mean to be said that? Ah, what is wrong with him? Since he failed to tell us what went wrong between him and Debbie, he must marry her. 
It's a promise. And that's the reason I came back. What nonsense. And it's away. And I paid for everything, including gift items. And they went home. The worst thing the matter is not showing any remorse. He's not even bothered. Uh, Anu, just calm down. Calm down. You don't need to worry. I will talk him into marrying Daddy. So just relax. Okay? It's a promise. <sighs> if you say so, better do it. You know you women, you always have ways of handling issues like this. That's why I told you, you should relax. Uh-huh. Um, have you taken your dinner? Let me go and make your dinner. So just relax. Don't need to worry. Thank you. Let me go and make dinner, okay? Thank you. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you my dear Yeah, hi. Yeah. 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 Okay, I'm looking for your boss, is it you? Uh, yes, yes. Can I see you? Okay, madam, hold on, I'm coming. Thanks, eh? My regards to you. Alright, sir. Thank you. I'll go on the way. Hello. Hello. What stunts do you think you are performing? Is it because Ella, Judith, and Hera have all gone back to London in the circumstances? Or your father, Jimmy, has gone back to Kaduna in northern Nigeria? Just tell me. Oh, 
worried. And how am I happy? How am I happy? Can't you see this love? I heard that according to some tradition, if Martins pays the bright price of my ex, send it. Automatically, my kids become his. Is that true? Of course, yes. Young man, this is a tradition. That a man will go home with kids knowing fully well that these kids are not his. Because they have returned your dowry to you. Is it about that? What happens to the DNA test and all that? That is the tradition. That is your Western and whatever you call it. It's a wrong tradition because their bloods will not match with this. Listen and listen good. You cannot change the tradition in this matter. Especially our ethnic group. And that is what it will be in this matter. So, be up and doing. Act quick.
Sometimes it is... Mystery. 